In July 2015, the girls and I were towing the horse float to a pony club event when a speeding, reckless driver hit us head on. My injuries were literally from top to toe. My face was degloved, my diaphragm was torn open, I had a compression fracture to my L5 vertebrae and my ankle was badly damaged, both dislocated and crushed. I'm Susan Evans. I live in rural Manawatu with my husband and three teenage girls. I remember bringing the children home in the car with me and explaining to them then that things were going to be very different for our family from here on in. After the accident, I spent several months in hospital and then at home with a hospital bed and wheelchair before I began to walk again. My ankle was salvaged as best it could be at the time, but it ended up going backwards. So the decision to amputate was made just over a year ago. And since then, my rehab has re-begun. I got involved in parasport after going to the ACC Parasport Open Day soon after my amputation. It was a great opportunity to see what was available and what the possibilities were. It's a really positive and encouraging environment. From there, I got sent an email about a paracycling open camp. I signed up for it before I even knew whether I could ride a bike again um, and started from there. I loved it. Getting back into sport has helped my rehab by giving me a strong focus and a reason to get as fit and active as I can. It's beneficial for my health and well-being and just being able to push myself as much as I can is great. If I was to give advice to someone who was thinking of getting into parasport, I would definitely say give it a go because you don't know what you can do until you've tried it. Everyone in the parasport sport community seems so positive and encouraging so it's a great environment to be part of and the opportunities are huge.